Hello and welcome. We're back in the Madison Lake Highlands volcanic area. And this year I've traveled to this uh, location a few times, um, looking for caves, as you may have seen in some of my old other videos. And those times I regularly passed this specific area that I am in now and which looked from a distance like just a, a barren lava flow but on a map that I recently found I saw that it was called Deep Caves. So I decided to stop on the side of the road and go explore and indeed I found this big cave. And by the way, this is very close to uh, the Jotdeen Ice Cave. And this is just a little bit more... Uh, yeah, what is it? North... Yeah, north, I think. And you would be even be able to walk here from the Jotdeen Ice Cave. Anyway, so I just decided to look here and at first it looked like a big, pretty inaccessible cave because of the, the big rocks that were on the entrance and didn't look too interesting, but still decided to scramble my way in and see what I would find. So that's what I'm doing now, slowly climbing over the rocks and going inside. And as I say so often on these videos, it's really difficult to get a sense of size but this is a pretty big cave and you can probably tell from the the pace in which I'm going that I'm just maneuvering big rocks to try to get in there. At first, when I, at this stage, I thought, oh, it's just like an, uh, a um, cave, as I had seen so many, with that just ends on a blind wall. But this cave happen, happened to be different as you will see in a little bit. Because at some point I saw a glimmer of light in the distance, so I decided to try to find my way through it. And also because this cave is so big, my the flashlights that I had with me were not really sufficient to, to light up the surroundings clearly. So that's why this is much more darker than other videos that I made in the caves.
But there in the distance, in the top, you can see some light coming through. So that's what I'm going towards and see what it is. Here, there's the light, and I wasn't clear if that was a big enough opening for me to go through, but uh, I'll give it a go. I'm climbing up here, trying to see if I can get out of the cave again through this opening that I see. And it turned out that this opening that was big enough for me to go through quite easily. So now finding my way out again. We are back at the ground level. You can see this is a big area collapsed. So this was a bigger cave, but it's mostly collapsed now. So going back to the very top. And then from here in the distance, at the, the edge of the trees, that's where the, the road is. So, pretty close to the road between Jotin Ice Cave and Madison Lake. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.